Hi, my name is Kosi Eze. Um, what was the other, other where part? Of, where am I from? I'm from Toronto, Canada, actually Mississauga, but nobody knows where that is. And um, who do I rep? I represent Warehouse Jack's crew all the way from Toronto, Canada. Rebels de la Soul, Symbiotic Monsters. Hey. I would say that it is. Um, I've been asked that question a lot, and I think it's because house was the first thing that felt like home. Um, being from Nigeria, um, it, it was the first thing that felt familiar, and I, it didn't, I didn't have to uh, learn too much. It felt natural to me, so it felt like home. Ah, the story. So I was in London, yes, for UK B-Boy Champs, and I missed my flight. I missed my flight here. And I was devastated. I was super sad. I remember texting a whole bunch of people saying, hey, I'm not going to make it. And this was something I had been looking forward to, Blueprint, for a year. And I was the saddest I could have ever be. But by the grace of I don't know what, but I just decided to talk to somebody before I left the airport. And this one woman was the sweetest, the nicest woman ever. She said, you know what? I'm just going to change your reservation for you. And next day, I'm on my way to Houston. It's been amazing. Coming off of um, something like UK B-Boy Champs, where I was uncomfortable. Um, not, not to say that I didn't have a good time. I was just felt uncomfortable being on the stage that big to come to something like Blueprint and be surrounded by people I knew, also people that I just met, heavy hitters, you know, in the in the community, OGs. I felt like it felt fresh, but it felt it felt good. It was a little bit of both. I um I've been told that I can be a little aggressive when I battle, but it was all love when I was battling. But it was also a lot of me wanting to represent myself, represent where I'm from. Um, Canada is a little bit of an underdog in a lot of things. So I just felt that uh, I had to really bring it. But apparently a blueprint, we're not underdogs because we've had four Canadians, but so far. <laughs> I thought, damn, you did it, you know? You almost didn't make it, but you did it. How did you do it? Um, in the final, I had felt my body um, giving up a little. I had been through a rough week and a half, um, and I had to really, really dig deep, and there was something else there. It wasn't just me. Um, so... I thought to whatever, to whoever helped me push past that finish line, I was really grateful. I think it's some of the best house music I've danced to in a battle so far. Yeah. Absolutely. It's definitely going to change the way that I share with people back home and people wherever I go. This has been a game changer for me. Um, like I said, being in the room with all the people that were here, I want to drop names, but um, it's really, really changed. My voice is cracking. <laughs>